Hey everybody, welcome to our week in check-in video for Psych 45's resource methods for Saturday, March 25th. Just going to go over a few reminders like I always do, similar to what I tell you in class to help you stay on top of things, but I know some of you don't make it to class, so that's part of why I do these. Uh, first up, as you know, your uh, Unit 3 exam is coming up this Tuesday on the 28th over Chapters 8, 9, and 10. Do take advantage of that study guide you'll find there at the bottom of Unit 3 on our Canvas course page, and do pay careful attention to those two areas on the study guide that you'll see italicized with asterisk all around it. That's going to be the content that your two short answer essay questions are based on. So do prepare for that so you can easily uh, pop in your answers. And I did go over that in, in class there uh, both Tuesday and Thursday, so do take advantage of that. Next up here is that your most recent discussion. Uh, I'm sorry, but going back to the exam for a moment, that your mind tap assignments for chapters 8, 9, and 10, don't forget that those are due at 5 p.m. right before our exam starts on Tuesday the 28th. So just a quick reminder about that. Next up here, as I was saying, your uh, discussion for chapter 10, that was due yesterday there on Friday, so most of you did a nice job with that. So they're uh, pretty easy designs, these non-experimental and quasi-experimental types there, and we covered those pretty intensely there on Tuesday and Thursday this week, so I feel hopefully that you uh, understood those pretty well. So um, good work there. Uh, next up here on Tuesday, we're going to go ahead and take our exam, the first part of class. Then we're going to start our next part of the course, which is Unit 4. And we are going to start uh, one of the most complex sorts of design chapters, and that's Chapter 11 on what are, on what are called factorial designs. And definitely uh, make sure you come to class for those lectures. I'm going to tell you that on Tuesday as well, because those are the most complex designs. And uh, it can be a lot of jet plane sound over your head if you don't have somebody walk you through, especially with some concrete examples, which we will spend a lot of time doing. It really helps. You just got to trust me. And you'll see that also in the lecture videos there, too. I really went to some great lengths to uh, explain those and show and tell those things, too, because otherwise it tends to get very lost upon students and from my past experience. So uh, definitely uh, check that out. All right, that was everything I wanted to say this time. Short and sweet. If you need anything in the meantime, reach out via email on Canvas, and I'll be glad to get back to you. Otherwise, I'll see you in class for our exam on Tuesday uh, next week. So. Take care until then. Bye-bye.